Hi, welcome to automation testing in. in this video we are going to see capture screenshots in action reports using C sharp the topics we are going to cover is taking screenshot capturing an extent report uh, as an automation tester uh, you will write so many scripts in your uh, project P while executing there is a chance of failure if there is any failure you want to capture that error and along with the screenshot in which screen the failure is for that you have to take a screenshot and you can put it in the html report for uh, here you have to uh, remember one thing is extent report will not take any screenshot uh, you have to take the screenshot separately using uh, selenium code or something like that then you have to pass that uh, screenshot path into your extent report then it will take the uh, screenshot from that folder where you have placed and that uh, and it will place in the extent report so we'll see how to take the screenshot and how we'll capture in the extent report uh, okay then we'll go to visual studio uh, here we are going to take two classes one is to take the screenshot and another is to how you'll capture in the extent reports I'll, I'll create a class add class get screenshot get screenshot and this class will be used to capture the screenshot we'll say this is an ut utility uh, code we can use in your project or framework well, we'll see like here it is automation testing that in this is my official site I have already written the blog for this I have code here let's copy from here and paste here okay we'll import web driver selenium and uh, this thing yeah I take screenshot is an interface in selenium so we have to con uh, type cast into driver object then you have to take the screenshot using the screenshot class you have a, cl a method called get screenshot and you have to place this screenshot into in some folder I have created a folder called error screenshots in this project structure add folder okay. then now I'm placing this screenshot with the screenshot name in this error screenshots folder okay. now this code will give you the path of your error screenshots then you have to save that uh, screenshot as uh, into PNG format then uh, this utility method will uh, give you back the path of this screenshot means written local path why because it is returning some string uh, it will give you the path of your screenshot this way you can capture the screenshot of your uh, failure whatever it may be then we'll use this code to capture uh, capture the screenshot in extent reports so now we'll take one more class add class I'll take capturing screenshot okay this is a unit project so I'll use in unit annotations test fixture the unit framework here we are going to use two main classes from the extent reports called extent reports and extent test extent reports I'll create an object for this extent test I'll create an object for this these are the two important classes in extent reports to capture the information and place into the uh, report extent reports uh, is used to uh, create an HTML file where you want to uh, capture the HTML report and extend test will capture the log information from your code and it will place into the report now I'll take one more 
i web driver driver i'll create an object for this i'll import driver also now we'll take one more and one time setup here we'll initialize some information public void i'll say init okay here we are going to capture some information like i'll capture this like i'll take this code and i'll place here this three lines will give you the path of your current project folder means extend demo youtube so now i want to create the pro report in this reports folder okay till he till the project path will give this one i'll append append to this reports and i'll capture the report in this reports folder now i'll say string report path equal project path plus i'll append that reports reports and i have to name uh, some i have to give some name to your report extent screenshot dot html with this name we are going to capture the uh, report now we have to say like extent object equal to new extent reports now you have to pass the report path here where you want to store this way in this reports folder you are going to create an extent report.html this is basic installation i have done now i'll write the actual test now i'll write the actual test public wide capture screenshot is a method now we'll write some sample code here we'll deliberately fail something then we'll see how uh, it will capture in the reports now we'll use test equal extend dot start test of we have to give the your method name here the start test method will indicate that from here it is starting the method so it will log that information from here in the report okay now driver equal to new firefox driver and then we'll import firefox driver now i'll say driver dot navigate dot go to url and i'll give called automation testing dot in i'll navigate to this url and i'll take the title of this page driver dot title and i'll assert this title for that i'll use assert dot r equal this is from test in unit i'll say home automation test actually the name is aut home automation testing but i am taking automation test and i'm comparing with the actual information which you are captured now both should be equal if there is a chance of failure it will capture before that i log this information like test dot log log status dot pass i must while I, while ex while writing any test cases we'll assume that something will pass so i'll say test passed if it get passed this information will be captured in the report otherwise it will go to i'll take tear down annotation now here we'll see something goes wrong what we have to do public void get result see uh, tear down will execute after each test method execution so if something goes wrong in this test it will go to the tear down and it will execute the code from this block now i'll say var status equal 
टेस्ट कॉन्टेक्स्ट डॉट करंट कॉन्टेक्स्ट डॉट रिजल्ट डॉट आउटकम डॉट स्टेटस इट विल गिव यू द स्टेटस ऑफ यूर टेस्ट केस नाउ आई से आई वॉन्ट टू कैप्चर वॉट एग्जैक्ट फेल्यूर ओके आई विल टेक प्री टैग मीन्स प्री टैग इन एच टी एम एल इट विल शो द जनरेटेड लॉग इन द फॉर्म ऑफ कोड सो प्री टैग आई क्लोज द प्री टैग एंड आई से हियर आई वॉन्ट टू कैप्चर दट लॉग इंफॉर्मेशन टेस्ट कॉन्टेक्स्ट डॉट करंट कॉन्टेक्स्ट डॉट सॉरी करंट कॉन्टेक्स्ट डॉट रिजल्ट डॉट स्टैक्ट्रेस इट इल गिव दैक्ट्रेस इंफॉर्मेशन नाउ आई वॉन्ट टू कैप्चर द एरर मेसेज वैर एरर मेसेज इक्वल टेस्ट कॉन्टेक्स्ट डॉट करंट कॉन्टेक्स्ट डॉट रिजल्ट डॉट मेसेज इट विल गिव यू द एरर मेसेज आई वॉन्ट टू प्लेस ऑल दिस इंफॉर्मेशन इन टू द रिपोर्ट वंस देर इज ए फेल्यूर ना एल से इफ स्टेटस इक्वल इक्वल टेस्ट सॉरी टेस्ट स्टेटस डॉट test status dot failed if the status equal failed then what you want to do so i'll take the screenshot string screenshot path equal get screenshot dot capture we have written this code previously null pass this driver object comma i have to give some name to the screenshot i'll name it as for example screenshot name okay i'll take the screenshot and place in this error screenshots folder using this screenshot name now i want now it will return the screenshot path now i have to use this path to place the report into sorry uh, screenshot into your report test dot log now i know that log status dot here is a failure why because because of failure only it came into this block so i know this one now i'll take stack trace plus error message i want to capture this information to the report apart from that i want to capture this screenshot for that you have to i'll say snapshot below well i have to capture for this you have to write test dot add screen capture is a method it will take your screenshot path as parameter and it will gen uh, capture the screenshot in this report i am done with this tear down method before that i'll say extent dot end test i have to end the test why because test got executed now i'll say one time tear down it will execute after completion of all liver tests in this class public void and report now here i'll say extent dot flush and extent dot close before that i'll say like driver dot 
close i am closing the driver and i am closing all the extent objects and i am clearing all the resources this is the sample test we have written to fail something and we'll capture the screenshot in this okay when well, i will run it and see what it will happen right click run tests it will launch the firefox browser it will navigate to the automation testing data and it will capture the title and it will assert if there is any failure it will go to the tear down method it will capture the screenshot it will place into the extent report it opened the browser it navigated to automation testing data in now it will capture the title and it will compare so it got closed now we'll see whether the error screenshot is captured or not we'll go to this folder and we'll see yeah it created a screenshot with the say screenshot named dot png now we'll go to the reports folder folder and we'll see whether it is see error screenshot dot html now i'll open this in the browser we'll see whether it captured the screenshot or not i'll open with chrome yeah you see that the pre condition pre tag looks like this there is a failure in line 3 uh, 38 and the expected length is 22 but it is 25 means it actually home automation testing but it was automation test and the snapshot below you can see that the snapshot is captured in this this way you can capture the screenshot okay yeah we have seen that taking screenshot and we'll capture the screenshot in extent reports thank you that's all in this video don't forget to subscribe to automation testing channel and please like us at our facebook page